Alright everyone, it is me, Judson Chad, and hopefully everyone had a good 4th of July weekend, because I know I did, uh, which basically considers just me just sitting at home. Uh, but anyway, it looks like my sleeping schedule has uh, more or less gotten much better. I'm actually getting like 7 to 8 hours sleep uh, per night, so uh, yeah, it was definitely because my body was taking too many calories, because before it was fine, but now that I've lost so much weight, that same calorie diet was now considered too high because I'm burning less calories, so, yeah. But anyway, I've been reading a lot of that advertising book. I've been playing a lot of uh, freaking Elite Dangerous and then something called King of Crabs now. And then, uh, yeah, it's just, uh, so I definitely have a rage-hate <coughs> rage -hate relationship with that game. So then I remembered, oh, uh, yeah, it's about the infinite game. You know, you can't win, so, you know, don't try to win. You know, basically it's a participation trophy. Because that's actually how you win. It's a paradox. Uh, but it was interesting because it seemed to be like a small studio. Or it's just one guy. And uh, I'm, I'm, I'm just curious to see how he handles complainers, right? So let's just go to a King of Crabs. Uh, six of ten. Yeah, I mean, the problem is... Uh, um, it's really, the, it, the gameplay really is a problem in this, uh, especially the controls. But now that I figure out you're supposed to use the keyboard, you know, yeah. Uh, so where is discussion? Where's the discussion board? Community hub? Uh, this, is, this is actually different from uh, when you're actually logging into Steam. Uh, there we go, discussions. Let's see. Oh, he looks like uh, he... You start a match, you get to swan them on, and there's one of those are busted. Yeah, it has to go over. Oh, it's the consumable. Oh, so it's not a bug. I got your beta because... Uh, but... Oh, I thought I was getting. Oh, oh, I. It's the fan of power up. Go figure. Alright, so anyway, just got rest of time. Oh, so I'm getting the power. Oh, he named the exact same thing. Yeah, in my case, I gotta make sure that the, the, my, see, my naming can, see, at least, see, when I was running my movie script for underdogs or underdoges, I realized the, the problem with repetition, saying the exact same thing over and over. It was just like some weird habit, and you, you fix it in the, um, in the subsequent drafts. In this, in this guy's case, he has to work on it, but obviously he's probably just one guy. So anyway, this guy is uh, correctly complaining about the movement. That's actually a problem with this game. The movement's a real problem. Uh, and then the collision and like just getting stuck is also really prob uh, annoying. Uh, he's complaining about the loot boxes, but it's a free-to-play game, so he's just being a fucking microtransaction asshole Andy. And then paid loot boxes, paid to win. It's like, like you're, you're playing a game for free and you expect everything to be free, and that's why I get like fucking annoyed. So he's being pretty nice. Uh, uh, yeah, so he's arguing that this, it's, uh, whatchamacallit, that there's microtransaction and shit, and he's being nice, the developer that is, but I'm thinking, like, you know, maybe I want to go to Mike Servitra and tell him to just fuck up and just delete his thread or something. You could argue that it's paid, but I think what, maybe what I'll do as a compromise is... If I'm deleting people's shit, I'll actually take the constructive part and then just say, this is an example of what is fine, you know, because this is the one thing I will not tolerate, people complaining about the loot boxes. It's like, it's a free-to-play game. I have to fucking pay for the server. Like, you know, w w like, what the fuck do you want? Uh, let's see, blah, blah, blah. My 
my my fuck tart neighbor next uh, next to me is smoking again. So I finally like it's like okay, so like I, I finally bought sealant foam from Amazon, it's like ten bucks or not. Oh, it's actually ten bucks after sales tax. So uh, it's not too bad, yeah, because at least something is kind of working. Like I'm using tape and cardboard, but it's like okay, I need to actually seal the whole thing airtight. So I was like. Oh yeah, why don't I just use that sealant foam stuff, right? I really want to avoid like the white collar thing where you have to get that really big, annoying, I don't know, weird pump thing that looks like a small little like submachine gun PP by Zong or something. Uh, so I was like, oh yeah, there's a canister that just has a spray paint. It's just disposable. Like yeah, that's exactly what I want because I don't want this like, you know, I don't want anything reusable. I just want to use it and then throw it away. You can always pay when you get a badge compared to someone investing money, and then, yeah, yes, you can find it by the time it's as you put it by that. Uh, it seems too high to call it paid progression. I think the game offer a uh, micro provision, but I don't think it's too cheeky. I mean, common crabs that get built often tiny, better than higher rarity one, and every crab seems balanced in their own way. Yeah, I mean, some crabs are really bad, but others are actually balanced. Balanced in like a. Like, the way it's designed is actually pretty well. Like, I'm still using the one to get the first one that they give you, the default one. It's actually really good. It's actually the most skill based one. So, anyway, I opened up that thread because uh, the way they, he's handling complaints, and I'm like thinking, how do I want to handle it? Like, I'm already still of the opinion that I'm just going to be like a huge asshole about it. But I do like the idea of, okay, I take what's constructive about it, and then I put that as a separate thread. Complaints, problems, right? Or something like that. So anyway, Kanye, uh, a lot has happened, uh, I guess, ish, and Kanye West has announced his run for president, but uh, predicted for some reason has not uh, uploaded. I think it's because he didn't file the paperwork, so it'll be interesting to see uh, if they'll do that. Because if Kanye enters the race, Donald Trump automatically wins the race, uh, race for sure. That's why he was doing really well, and then you know the markets are trying to adjust for you know the Kanye West thing. Uh, speaking of which, Kanye West. Uh, well, he can definitely affect it. Uh, the problem, billion given millions in federal aid, uh, blah blah. Yeah, he has to file the he has to file the paperwork, and more importantly, he can run as president in the swing states. That's where it's most important. He uh, the the states that it's too late to run for president because the ballot deadline's too late. It's like New York and like I, with the exception of New Mexico, I think it's all like liberal states anyway. So whatever. Right, and Illinois, I think, is Illinois a swing state? I tend to think it's now swing, it's swing or tends to go out to the left because of fucking all the shit lives in Chicago. So anyway, uh, we'll have to see how it goes. Uh, Bitcoin searches for the, what the hell's wrong with this? Bitcoin searches for last week are, or, no, for this week is at nine. Oh, Google is actually pretty early this week. Uh, oh yeah, that's right. I forgot that I was going to mention uh, something about the James E. coin swap. Uh, yeah, we're just going to do the coin swap. Uh, Mitch is currently, let me check the messages. What, what part is he up to? Uh, he is a week away from the final version. All right, so this is just going to be a heads up. Uh, I think we'll probably, like, it's just a heads up. It's not the swap yet, but we're getting ready for the swap. So it'll just be like last time. So probably in a couple of weeks we'll have everything squared up and then I'll make the video post. It's like, here's the swap, here are the details, it'll be the same as 404. This time I'll make sure to uh, inform all the exchanges, you know, hopefully they're not angry from last time over the, you know, apparently botched 404 coin swap. I don't understand why they didn't get the message, but oh, it, was a me it was a huge mess, but, you know, luckily it was just small exchanges, so it wasn't affecting us too much, but yeah. Anyway, uh, um, so what you might call it? Uh, so yeah, so that's pretty much it. And I'll, I'll write it in the description there, so because I, I looked at my YouTube analytics, a lot of people don't actually watch. It's just well, they watch like the first couple minutes and they drop off. So I guess people people are more interested in my banter than my news analysis. So that kind of sucks, but that, that's to be expected because you know people are interested in politics, but then YouTube bans that shit. So. It's like you can't win, and then I could go to the bit shoot, but then it'll jeopardize my games going mainstream. So it's like it's uh, like there is just no free speech, period. All right. So anyway, uh, Bitcoin was having a nice rally. Looks like it kept most of its gains. I'm gonna refresh this one more time just to be sure. I'm gonna refresh this because now we should have uh, this updated. 
Yeah, this is correct. Very good. All right, so Bitcoin down 63.6%. It's actually going down, which means all coins are increasing. So that's what we want. 24 hour is a little better at 64 billion. Uh, that's coming off a weekend. Uh, Bitcoin is 92.50, so it retains its little upward swing. Litecoin's at 43.42, so it's also up a little bit, but not going up much further. Uh, Doggy coin, 345.3 million. So this thing is way up. Holy shit, it is way up. Damn it, I wish I uh, held more dog coin. <clears throat> so stocks went up a shit ton yesterday, and today it's down just a little bit. But it just started, so we'll have to see. S&P 500 drops, pacing to end a five-session winning streak as it now fires. Uh, okay, so yeah, basically everything just kept going way back up. Now it's going down a little bit. Uh, they're still peddling fake news uh, economist Norio Rubini. He hates Bitcoin. Um, also, Ghislaine Maxwell is being sent to the exact same prison that Jeffrey Epstein uh, was staying at. So basically, um, they're going to kill, uh, kill her off too. So, yeah, she knows too much. Uh, I guess, the, I guess uh, Mossad decided that she was too dangerous, so they let her get arrested. Um, so what I don't understand is why don't they just simply offer in Israel and just don't tell anybody about it or just lie and just say, oh, yeah, she's in. Um... Well, actually, if you think about it, a lot of people are still asking a lot of questions. So, yeah, I guess I guess they have to do it this way. I mean, it's not like they give a shit, right? I mean, they, they killed Jeffrey Epstein and, nobody, and not, nobody's investigating. So shocking level of bipartisan support us for not be China. Uh, for big tech change. Okay, this is actually major, so we're going to do that. <clears throat> Spawn predictor. No, Dow Jones, fear of hot data, leak coronavirus, stock market, blah, blah, blah. Okay, so basically there's literally nothing new. All right, so Kanye West needs to hurry the fuck up and uh, fix his paperwork so he could get on the b uh, ballot and predict it. Because uh, predict it has refused to list him, so uh, let me see. Gambling odds, Kanye West. Pres I just want to see if he's being listed. That's what matters. Uh, ten thousand percent sports betting dime. Uh, I need an actual gambling site. Uh, if I swap my proxy to United Kingdom. Okay, plus ten thousand. So there you are saying. All right. So Kanye West is listed. Who are they taking it from? Okay, how about odds checker? Let's see. This should be a real gambling site. No, it's just another fucking article. Um, all right, so Kanye West uh, is on the same. Okay, so they listed Kanye West as 50, uh, 50 to 1 or 1 to 50. I don't know how I'm supposed to read this. Percent of bets since... Kanye West tweet. All right, so a lot of people are betting. Okay, all right. So he is being listed in some places. Uh, Bert Biden. Oh yeah, I am running a poll too. Let me uh, let me take a look here. Russia Blood Breaking Mary failed. Okay, so at least he's gonna redo the DACA paperwork. So it actually turns out that DACA is gonna end. It's just that the Supreme Court just decided to do some uh, bullshit. Uh, of course, Chief F word, John Roberts, but. Uh, where's my poll? Where's my poll? Yeah, I'm actually gonna retweet this. Yeah. That was so dumb. I forgot I gotta not do that. Um, yeah. Because it goes to the bottom. Alright, so most people pretty much think it's gonna split the Joe Biden vote, but others are saying, oh no, I'll split the Trump vote or I'm not gonna answer shit. I'm actually kind of surprised that a lot of people are not answering. So I'm actually thinking a lot of Democrats might actually be voting in this. Uh, oh, that was a funny picture. Uh, can't control them. Black Lives Matter. Blah, blah. I just want to see if they're going to ban Tucker Carlson. Uh, I don't know who this cunt is. Swanson. Okay, blah, blah, blah. All right. So, yeah, they're going to deplatform Tucker Carlson after uh, if Joe Biden wins. So it's going to be uh, it's going to be pretty nasty. All right. So let's see. We're pretty good here. All right. Oh, yeah. Thank you to one person that subscribed. Because I've been reading more of my um, advertising book, I'm thinking maybe I want to run a YouTube ad. 
to grow my subscribe base. <clears throat> because let's face it, uh, free is not really free. <clears throat> God, the fucking smoker next door is really fucking things up for me. So, alright, I should refresh this. Looks like the uh, proxy's not doing well. God, is it really fucking smelling like smoke in my fucking day? I'm just not. Are you serious? Yeah, they were supposed to fix the ceiling foam, uh... God, the fucking illegals that worked on this fucking apartment the one next door just did such a bad fucking job. Ugh, well... Hopefully I'll be able to fix it this coming Thursday and then I just do ceiling foam on the whole thing and then I should solve it. Alright, I don't know what the fuck's wrong with Crex. Actually, it's probably the, uh, the proxy. Alright, I'm just gonna read it off of my Chrome. Uh, so JMC coin is at uh, eight to nine, so it's doing really well. What what else is not working? Okay, here we go. Oh, okay, yeah. So eight to nine, so it's doing pretty well. Looks like it's heading towards ten. Four hundred four, same thing. Three fifty one, three seventy. So everything except JMC coin went down as Bitcoin was skyrocketing. So we definitely know, uh, you know, this is gonna be vulnerable to a skyrocketing in Bitcoin price. So. Uh, Hopefully the pressure won't be too bad. Uh, two by two is at sixty nine or seventy one. So I mean, I'm gonna guess that like, let's say Bitcoin skyrockets to I don't know thirty thousand, twenty thousand. Then two by two, everything is gonna be slashed in half for sure, probably. Uh, of, of course, except uh, JMC coin. And then we're gonna be doing the swap. So um, actually, I don't know. Maybe four hundred four won't go down too much because the supply is still uh, quite very much under uh, quite a lot of control. Uh, two by two. Oh, I already went over that. Uh, Rick's ha uh, Rick's has been like the biggest uh, uh, biggest hit, but that's because the price was ar was uh, was ar was already way too high. So now it's finally coming down to what it should be. <sighs> the the fucking cigarettes. Oh. Luckily, I'm going to Target today. So. Oh my God! It's starting to get really fucking insane. <clears throat> so. Um, yeah, so I've actually been buying Ricks uh, a little bit now, so. But I have to come up with some money to make sure that we have enough for the swap. And I'm paying for the compile of the final version of the wallet, so, yeah. Alright, so I rethink that person. Um, I don't know, I mean, I'm not sure what getting... I'm not sure what advertising for more subscribers is going to really do for this channel. Uh, especially since I'm not really looking to make money off of this, just to grow my influence, so. I don't know, but I, mean, I was watching a YouTube tutorial, and the guy said, for just five bucks a day, you can grow your channel. So it's like, that's actually not bad for five bucks a day. Uh, that's, you know, assuming 30 days on average, that's 150 bucks to get more subscribers. You know, and this would be targeted people, too. So they'd, be, they'd actually be interested in what I'd uh, be talking about. Major Tesla investor brands Bitcoin contender for the first global digital... Uh, wait, what? Major... Tesla investor branch out of Kentucky. Oh, okay. I'm getting so distracted by the cigarette smoke, I can't even think about this. Australia Post now lets customers pay for Bitcoin at 3,500 outlooks. Uh, well, that's good. Funny enough, the book I'm reading, uh, Sell Like Crazy, uh, he's uh, situated in Australia. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Okay, junk, junk. Bitcoin fails to make China's top 10 crypto list. Uh, that's already old news, by the way. All right, so there's nothing on Google. No thanks. Ripple except compare XRP earnings on the just on. Wait, what? Oh, okay, so that's just more Ripple stuff. So that's good. So even though I don't like Ripple itself, especially because it's decentralized, it's very good what they're doing. Because just get everybody on blockchain. That's what matters, right? And then once everyone's on block, because it's like because because we don't think about it now, but it's like trying to convince people to stop using gold and silver and using paper money. This was actually a thing uh, uh, hundreds of years ago. All right, but now it's ubiquitous, ubiquitous all right, which means everyone's using it, right? Ubiqu ubiquitous. <coughs> I almost spelled it correctly. 
Present appearing and found everywhere. Oh yeah, exactly. Found everywhere. Yeah. So everyone's so it's so it's everywhere, right? Everyone's using it, right? Bitcoin and cryptocurrency is uh, pretty much in that phase, getting everyone to use cryptocurrency. So, uh, so this is very good. Uh, this fucking piece of shit next door. One of the richest Bitcoin. No, don't care about that. Remarkably accurate Bitcoin analyst reveals crypto forecast debate on market direction. Ta -da. Bitcoin analysts who correctly predicted Bitcoin validity beats ahead of crypto's so essential vector could boost Bitcoin. Okay, wait. Uh, oh, okay. So Visa. All right. So we don't need to read this, but the, I've already talked about this like a ton. And yeah, this makes sense because again, everyone's going to get used to the idea of using crypto. In fact, even the credit card companies are going to have to use crypto too. Crypto friendly wraps you in way running for president. Yeah, we already covered that. Okay, no. Mm. Wait, he's wait. Oh yeah, wait. He's pro Bitcoin. I don't want to read the whole thing, but um, uh, he talked about Bitcoin in our oh, Jesus Christ uh, interview with Charlemagne the God in May twenty. So I didn't even click the fucking tweet and it started going into the Twitter because I was clicking here, but then for some reason, piece of shit Firefox thought I was clicking up here. It's like such a garbage browser. God, I really hope Tunnel Bear comes out with Brave support. We go back to fucking Brave. Uh, I was in my when we Bitcoin when I saw her time. Wait, yeah, that was the month I want to use Bitcoin. I want to use Bitcoin, so I saw her time and twenty dollar bill. Uh, okay. Well, I mean, Kanye always deliberately says kind of weird shit, but all right, whatever. He's pro Bitcoin. That's all that matters. We went over that. Arcane Reap, no. Only a shift will, no. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Okay, so basically, there's literally nothing new with uh, crypto. Uh, let's see. Trump. Uh, this was Jude. What? Oh, okay. I guess this is the whole thing. Joe, I stand in it. Uh, Mount Rushmore. Yes, he is doing the correct thing with the Mount Rushmore stuff. He he's showing a nice tall wall. I don't know if it's a new wall though, so we'll have to leave it at that. All right, I I have to cough out this phlegm. So where is my? All right, there we go. All right, <sighs> fucking asshole next door. Yeah, no, smokers just never want to fucking get rid of their fucking cigarettes either, no matter how much damage they fucking do. They really are scum of the earth. At the heart of Twitter, uh, Trump's Twitter spat a shocking level of bipartisan support. Okay, uh, growing support. Alright, we don't need a history. Okay, so shit lives and Republicans are voicing increasing their tail over liability protections over this stuff. Uh, even Yahoo finds saying that change is coming. Uh, if Trump is re-elected, frankly, even if he isn't re-elected, you might see variations from coming to some type of effect. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Okay. First of all, this is bullshit. The Democrats. First of all, the Democrats are going to change it so that, like, conservatives could just never be on social media. Ever before, back in 2018, by permanent action 2013, uh, for Korea, trafficking sex minors. The fact that it would come together is huge, but on the week of blah blah blah, long internet callback, some say that's enough for all coming out and seriously assess the cost community. Okay, the Trump administration's choice target section during the space of a month, uh, reform, uh, yeah, Congress is also going around with Democratic energy, teaming up to, on bills to address the lost perceived shortcomings. All right, Brian Schatz, a Democrat from Hawaii, and John Thune, Republican from South Dakota. He treated the pack which will expose platforms of federal civil claims. So that's good. And allow these to appeal of platforms moderation actions. Yes. Separately, the Senate's Earn It Act, introduced by GOP Lindsey Graham. That's a shock. With backing from Connecticut's Richard Blumenthal and our Derek is headed to a full Senate vote. Holy shit, this actually sounds real. The measure seeks to remove the liability shield for platform that failed to meet standard for providing sexually, but a higher security priority that the bill safer is, but back to a rob of the you know, crypto. Oh. What? Wait. So this is a bullshit thing then. 
Okay. The measure seeks to remove the liability shield for platforms that fail to meet standards for preventing sexual harass carrying projects area that builds stated purpose of okay. Uh okay, so Okay, so the Democrat interest in legislation that would remove liability protections for big tech companies that knowingly publish false political advertisements. So this is an attack on Republicans. Yeah, so I, so I, I, I knew it. This is bullshit. Oh, we should have the right brand of especially a mix of for me. Something's gonna happen. New general likely before next year, a planning party can count on a host of right of the year kind of must be police more grand to defend against ensuing lawsuits, car uh blah blah blah. blah, blah. Uh, well, I thought a big car could pay me fake millions of dollars a day, 10 pounds on wax channel, or I got a good good day. Say that from one event to two years, it wipes out the bulk of user generated kind of based claim in the early state litigations that cut your bills a lot. Yeah, there's nothing here about fucking censorship. Let's do a control F on censor. Yeah, the word censorship doesn't even show up here. Okay, so I'm gonna call this a fake, fake article, or a fake law. Additional response rule will require platforms to scale up on content moderation, so that means they want more censorship. Pays up to blah blah blah. Uh, so they're increasing their censorship teams. Uh, let's see. Okay, blah blah. blah. More monitors they go pro aim to amend. Okay, so they're gonna amend section two thirty so that they can actually have more censorship. And then when you get censored, you can't sue the fuck. This is such a bullshit order. Uh, let's see. Okay, so they want it. So they don't want to allow free speech. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. All right, so it's just, yeah. So that's why Lindsey Graham's behind it. So like I start, I was like, at first I was like, yeah, that's pretty impressive. And then I realized that we read more of it, it just turns out to be more censorship. So it's all, it's all the same old bullshit. Just like my fucking asshole next door neighbor with his smoking. Anyway, if you like what you saw, read or heard, hit the like button, the follow button, or subscribe button from where you're watching this from, or my YouTube's at youtube.com forward slash uh, JMC radio. Make sure you smash that subscribe button on the right hand side of this page to continue growing this channel. So I'm actually thinking about reducing my content to maybe three times, <clears throat> three times a week. Um, I think maybe I'll have to talk to my fucking retarded neighbor or something, but that's not going to do much. Uh, so uh, what should I call it? Um, yeah, but I, I don't know about that because I, I don't even want to do because fi- uh, I don't even want to do five days a week, especially since now I know I'm not getting too much out of it. So, I, I don't know, I have to think about it, but, you know, I think for now we'll try maybe three times a week, because uh, I would like more time to play my games, read my books, and then, you know, go back to programming, because I've halted all programming until I finish my advertising book. So, yeah. So anyway, uh, God, this fucking smoker, man. Now my apartment smells like fucking cigarette smoke, it's pissing me off so much. So anyway, uh, I'll see you all in uh, tomorrow's video. Thanks for watching. And yeah, not really much happening. So uh, again, uh, everything kind of hinges. I mean, Donald Trump's doing what he can, but he's really behind by a lot. So if Kanye West fo- follows the paperwork and we see him here, I'm predicted, then uh, we're gonna then we're gonna have a good time. So because Kanye West cannot win, but he will steal all of uh, Joe Biden's votes. So and he'll definitely take all the black votes too. Um, with the exception of black conservatives. But black conservatives would have voted for Trump or Kanye anyway. And uh, knowing that they're not going to vote for Joe Biden is basically a vote for Trump. So, it, it, But all the Democrat blacks that were, would have gone for Joe Biden are definitely going to vote for Kanye West. So that's going to be very important, especially in swing states. And then that combined with Trump getting back uh, in good graces with the white vote, that should be enough to get him reelected. So we'll have to see. Um, so yeah, but we're not quite out of the woods yet. So anyway, see you all tomorrow. Thanks for watching, and always remember Johnson Chan, James C. Coin. Uh, it's gonna be a swap, but not yet. So we're letting you know now. Four four coin. Uh, yeah, I guess we'll just make this the thumbnail because we literally didn't have anything else. So.